I'm standing here inside the UCCC lobby with Holly Berg, curator of exhibits for the Greeley Museum System, and we're talking about a really exciting exhibit coming to the Greeley History Museum that's part of a collaboration you might already know a little bit about if you regularly tune into Inside Greeley. Holly, what are we talking about today? We are talking about a super exciting project that has multiple facets, kind of a whole big deal. Um, with the Greeley Museums, the Greeley Philharmonic Orchestra, and supported by the Weld Community Foundation and the City of Greeley, all the big players involved. And that is a symphonic work composed by Dylan Fixmer, and it's called um, Seven Symphonic Portraits, mm. a Weld County Reflection. Ooh, okay, so seven symphonic portraits. If you watched our earlier segment with Dylan, you know he talked a little bit about what makes a symphonic portrait and his inspiration. And he mentioned to us when he was talking to us that to compose these works that will be performed by the Philharmonic Orchestra, he did a lot of collaboration with you. So tell me a little bit about that and how the museum's team helped him prepare for his work. Absolutely. So. Dylan really wanted to get a sense of what Weld County was all about. And to do that, he wanted to know what the people were all about. So he did a lot of traveling around, he talked to a lot of people, and then he spent many, many hours in our archives. He listened to a lot of our oral histories, our recorded interviews with historical people. And he pulled out a lot of inspiration and quotes, and that's how we came up with the themes for the different sections. So by the time um, he came to me to work on this exhibit project, he already had the music mostly composed and the themes already decided. So we were able to take those themes and pull out real concrete examples of um, stories throughout our shared history and put them on display that correspond to each movement and each theme. Wonderful. Now, if you are standing here with me, it's mid-October. The performance is on October 14th, but when you're watching at home, you go, hey, it's November. Did I miss it? They didn't miss it. So this is not the only way to see this exhibit, correct? Yeah, exactly. So this is a, a two-prong thing. It's a big project. And so it's going to appear the evening of the performance. But if you guys missed it, it will open at the Greeley History Museum. We're going to pick everything up and transport it over there and plop it in a gallery. And you guys can see it there. Cool. And you told me a really awesome thing before we were on camera about how people will be able to experience the composition and the visual exhibit side by side. Tell me a bit more about that. Yeah, absolutely. So, of course, visitors to the performance are going to walk through the display before they go hear the music live. But the Greeley Philharmonic Philharmonic is generously donating a recording of this performance and so visitors to the exhibit will be able to listen to the music as they walk through the performance. Wonderful. So if you're excited about a collaborative experience in the art world, visual stimulation about the history of our region, brand new world premiere work and enjoying them at the same time, sort of engaging all of your senses in the work, you have to check out this exhibit, which will be at the Greeley History Museum. It is opening sometime in mid-November. The dates are still being finalized, and so if you would like to know more about the exhibit, you're going to have to go to that GreeleyMuseums.com.